Hello guys, what's up? I'm Surush Designer and today I want to talk about Lumion rendering. So when you open the Lumion, you can see this type of windows in here. For example, you have your computer speed. It shows you what is your statics in here. You can click on the setting button. If you want to work very smoothly, you can change your editor resolution to the 66 and editor quality to the low quality. For some type of re systems don't have any type of high configs and measurements recoveries all the things must be good do not enable high tree editor because it takes lots of RAM and speed if you have some type of low config systems so we have some type of examples between computer speed for example these examples done by the Alumios company and workers you can see that these type of things in here very good very realistic but don't worry if you take this tutorial to the end you can create some type of projects much realistic than the past so the load option helps you to load your lumion files you created before or now and the new project is useful for your starting i'm gonna start with the plain project as you can see template has been loading for us and we can wait to load it don't worry about the not response in here because lumion actually is one of the high config softwares in architect and now it's loaded for us so i'm gonna start with the moving options when i press w i can move forward and i press s i can move backward when i press a i can go to left and d for the right actually you have some guidelines in here for example we have the uh, for example we have space and shift i want to move faster i'm gonna press space actually you can see now we get much low speed than the past and when i press shift i will run or walk much faster than the past so when I press a space, it's moved very quickly. And you can see these type of things in here. This is our gizmo in Lumion. And you can easily go and reach to it in every place you have. Another option we have, for example, is about slow speed. I want to press S for the backward and hold space on my keyboard. Now I can walk much slower than the past. For the uh, height options, we have different type of keys, but the main keys in the Lumion is Q and E. When I press Q, I go upside, and I press E, I come downside. So you must hold all of these keys now, and you can see you can easily move in the Lumion environment. So for the uh, these type of boxes in here, in this place, you can see how much of your ram in use and how much fps or 3d points you have in here at the layer option you can categorize your objects or 3d models for making your renders much realistic and manageable at the uh, right side at the uh, bottom you have different type of things in here for example when i move my mouse on this question box you can see different type of gu guidelines in the uh, Lumion in this place you have the uh, photo option when I click on it for example you have the different type of things in here it's really useful it's really realistic your renderings because you have lots of styles in here with different type of FX tools called add effects for example something like that and when you want to come back to your belt, you just want to click on the belt option in here. Another thing we have is about the movie. You can create your animations in here. And we have panorama things in here. So you can save your files anywhere you want. Save as. And you can save your files any place you want. I want to click on the belt option. At the... Uh, actually at the left side of the uh, Lumion at the uh, button 
we have different type of things for moving objects for example i'm going to click on the transport double click on it and for example i want to add this car on my surface like this for example now i want to select all and deselect i will come to the transport option for selecting my car like this and you can move it easily on the aluminum very simple and easy another option we have is the moving horizontal you can only move your objects on the horizontal lines like that another is about vertical movement you can increase the uh, height of your object and for example you increase the height of this car but now you are remorse and you want to turn it back on this landscape so you can click on the move free option hold this and now you can press F on your keyboard to conform it to your landscape very simple and easy for any type of objects in Lumion we have right window like this you can see that you can set it on the for example landscape or conform it to the landscape you can change the color of your cars very simple and easy like this and you can turn on the lights like that very simple and easy and really good you can show the driver by clicking on it as you can see now i want to move it forward when i turn it off actually my glasses go to the black side and i want to show the drivers i can see these drivers like that very simple and easy you can change the color of your cars and you can turn off the show driver in here so it's about the uh, starting with the Lumio for the final thing you can select it and you can delete it very simple and easy i hope you enjoyed this video like and subscribe don't forget it Lumion have lots of lessons about rendering and I will talk about it at the next sessions. So please subscribe us, we need your help and goodbye.